Apple just released the watchOS 11 update and it's packed with fitness features. But in your case, if you're unable to update your Apple Watch, it's stuck on preparing for a long time, keeps downloading but the progress bar doesn't move, and it shows errors like unable to verify update, unable to install update, software update failed, etc. Then don't worry cause I'll show you how you can fix any watchOS related issues on your Apple Watch with some easy to follow troubleshooting steps. Even though we are using Apple Watch Series 9, this process will work on any Apple Watch that's watchOS 11 compatible. Here's the list. To update your Apple Watch to watchOS 11, you'll also need to ensure that your iPhone has the latest iOS installed. Then you'll need to check that your Apple Watch has enough storage and has at least 50% battery. And it's recommended that you keep it connected to a charger while you're updating. Now, if you're updating your watch from the watch itself, then make sure that your watch is connected to a Wi-Fi network. And if you're having issues updating your watch with a 2.4G network, then try switching to 5G and vice versa. And in case you're updating from phone, keep your phone and your watch nearby and make sure that Wi-Fi and Bluetooth is turned on on both devices. After following these basic steps, if you're still having trouble updating, then restart both your iPhone and your Apple Watch and try the update again. If it fails and it's stuck on preparing, then deleting the watches update file and starting it from scratch has fixed it for most users. You can do that from either your watch or your phone's watch app. We will go with our iPhone. So open the watch app, then go to general, scroll down and select storage. Now tap on watchOS and hit delete. After that, you shouldn't be stuck on pending or downloading. If deleting the update file didn't help, then we will move to the final step that will fix it for all of you. For this, you'll need to unpair your watch from your iPhone. After it's unpaired, set up your watch again, but don't restore backup. So set it up as a new watch. After that, try updating your watch and it should work. And when your watch is updated, if you want to restore your data, then you'll need to unpair and set it up again, but this time select restore backup. And that's all. Now your Apple Watch is updated to watchOS 11 and you have all your data intact. So let us know which step worked and if you found this helpful, let us know by giving this video a thumbs up, subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.